Few entertainers have worked as hard as Whoopi Goldberg to earn her place as one of Hollywood's most accomplished stars. Thanks to her success, she's been able to invest in luxury real estate across the country, from her current New Jersey home to a farm in Vermont and more. Aside from being an actress and comedian, Whoopi's role as a host on The View has earned her an annual salary nearing $8 million alone. Whoopi's impressive real estate portfolio includes a Victorian style home in Berkeley, a 745 acre farm in Vermont, and even a stunning Manhattan apartment. She also formerly owned a jaw dropping mansion in Los Angeles Pacific Palisades. First, let's look at Whoopi's former Pacific Palisades estate. Built in the 1930s for Austrian author Vicky Baum and later purchased by actor David Niven, Whoopi purchased this home in 1993 and owned it for nearly 25 years. Situated on the Amalfi Rim, the 7,000 square foot main house sits on a 28,000 square foot lot surrounded by lush landscaping and ivy covered walls, offering privacy in this star studded neighborhood. Highlights of the home included five ensuite bedrooms, seven bathrooms, an in ground pool, and sweeping views of both the ocean and canyon. There's even a guest house over the garage that serves as the perfect spot for visitors. Whoopi sold this property in 2018 for nearly $9 million. Next, we have Whoopi's expansive farm estate in Vermont, which she bought in 2004 in the rural Green Mountains. Located near Marlboro, this 745 acre estate features 640 acres of conserved land that can never be developed, 65 acres of pasture, and 15 miles of horse and buggy trails. There's also a 22 acre sugar bush used for making Vermont's famous maple syrup. Portions of the main house date back to the 1700s and the colonial style home has undergone extensive renovations while preserving its historic charm. With wide plank wood floors, rustic wood beams and exposed posts, this 6,000 square foot home features four bedrooms, three full and two half baths. Whoopi even added modern amenities like a heated horse barn, an indoor riding arena, and a woodworking shop. She reportedly sold this property in 2012 for $1.55 million. In 2015, Whoopi sold one of her longest owned properties, a classic home in central Berkeley, California, which she owned for over 30 years. The beautifully restored 1890 Victorian style home featured a New Orleans inspired front porch and columns. And it was one of Whoopi's final connections to Berkeley, where she began her journey towards becoming an EGOT winner. Emmy, Grammy, Oscar, Tony. You know? The property consisted of a 1,455 square foot main house and a two story cottage, originally a barn, now converted into 1,635 square feet of living space, complete with a second kitchen and full bathroom. This estate includes two structures, the restored Victorian house and a two-story barn-turned cottage. It's unclear if Whoopi ever resided here, but she purchased it in 1985, the same year she made her Broadway debut and starred in Steven Spielberg's adaptation of Alice Walker's The Color Purple. Originally from Manhattan, Whoopi moved to Berkeley from Southern California in the late 1970s. There, she joined the Black Street Hawkeyes, the city's oldest avant-garde theater troupe. As a single mother at the time, she developed a relationship with David Sheen, a writer and performance artist who co-founded the group in 1975. Together, they created The Spook Show, which premiered at 2019 Blake Street in the early 1980s. Finally, we come to Whoopi's main residence, a Georgian colonial style mansion in West Orange, New Jersey. Purchased in 2009 for 2.8 million, this impressive home boasts eight bedrooms, six full and two half bathrooms, and sits in the exclusive Lulin Park enclave. Built in 1927, the estate has nearly 9,500 square feet of space and it's protected by secure gates. Whoopi was drawn to this property for its vintage charm, including original bathroom tiles that she fell in love with. 
She often hosts gatherings for her friends and family in her spacious dining room and spends her time relaxing in this elegant yet welcoming home. Her home boasts 23 rooms in total, equipped with luxurious spaces like a grand kitchen, indoor gym, pool, and outdoor patio. Whoopi's decorated her home with mahogany furniture and a collection of cherished artwork and photos. In an interview with New York Magazine, she shared how her artistic taste is reflected in the decor. She said, I'm sort of eclectic. The periods kind of clash all over the house, which is great for me. It feels like you can hang out. Beyond its impressive amenities, Whoopi appreciates her New Jersey home for the privacy it offers. She explained in 2019 that her move from the city was driven by the need for personal space. That is what brought me to Jersey because I lived in the city and had no way of sitting outside. Every time I would go sit outside, 50 people would come and hang out, she noted. Although Whoopi loves people, she longed for a place where she could relax outdoors in peace. After exploring New Jersey with her work partner, she found her dream home in 2009. One of her favorite perks of living in the area is being a short drive from Atlantic City's casinos. I'm a huge fan of Atlantic City, she shared. It's great to be in New Jersey. Inside, Whoopi's mansion boasts wood floors, a grand staircase, crown molding, and elegant finishes. Her decor is deeply personal, influenced by her friendship with Elizabeth Taylor. The home is also perfect when it comes time for the holiday season, offering ample space for her large Christmas tree. Her master bedroom features a spacious closet, ideal for her shoe collection, while the kitchen centerpiece is a large wooden table where she enjoys playing dominoes as seen on Instagram. Her bathroom's uniquely designed with floor to ceiling tiles. Whoopi Goldberg has settled into her home so comfortably that she jokingly calls herself the laziest woman on earth. Because I am in my house and I am very happy, she said in the past. After looking at Whoopi's properties over the years, we can see her hard work has paid off. Her stunning Georgian colonial mansion in West Orange, New Jersey is a perfect reflection of her eclectic style, rich artistic influences, and love for privacy. It's no wonder Whoopi finds so much joy and comfort in her home. Whether she's enjoying the peaceful surroundings or indulging in her favorite hobbies, this incredible property is truly her personal sanctuary. For today, that'll wrap up this house tour. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram if you'd like to chat, and I'll see you all in another one. Bye.